My name is Bob Giacomo Antonio. Uh, I started LGO this past academic term and I'm in the class of 2013. I did my undergrad work at Carnegie Mellon University in Pittsburgh where I grew up. I uh, did a dual degree in mechanical engineering and biomedical engineering. Um, right out of college I decided to go and work for General Electric because I was very interested in getting involved in operations rather than engineering at the time. So I worked for General Electric's transportation division in Erie, Pennsylvania building diesel electric locomotives. I did their operations management leadership program, which is a two-year rotational program doing leadership development work through all kinds of various aspects of their supply chain. From there, I went to Westinghouse Electric Company, where I wanted to get some more engineering experience and get a little closer to home for the time being. So I was working in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. I spent about two years there in a nuclear power plant's engineering role, working on the development of their AP1000 power plant. At the time, I had always known that I, I wanted to go back to business school. Uh, so at around five years of work experience, I decided that it was now or never. So I decided to start looking around. I wanted to do an operations heavy program, but still get some exposure to, to business acumen and financial strategy type work because I was very weak there. So I started looking around. I looked at MIT Sloan because I knew MIT was a very quantitative program and Sloan, I thought, would give me exactly the, the toolkit that I would want. When I was researching operations at MIT, I came across the LGO program and one spin around the literature surrounding what the program brings to the table and the things that it can teach you uh, about operations and management together, I was, I was hooked. Um, so I, I applied immediately and haven't looked back since. So I'm about a third of the way through my internship, off-cycle internship with Nike in Beaverton, Oregon, which is just outside of Portland at their world headquarters campus, which is amazing. Uh, it's a really cool role uh, because I've sort of been using Nike equipment my whole life as a, as a sports enthusiast and as, as an athlete. So to, to be involved in their supply chain and actually sort of the, the genesis of those products is a really unique opportunity. Specifically, I'm working in a supply chain innovation role, looking at how Nike brings product to market and sort of the value proposition that they have to their customers. So a typical Nike product takes anywhere from three to six months to manufacture and deliver but Nike would really like to be able to offer a, a set of products to their customer in six days. So the, the challenge of being able to offer something with a very short lead time toward your, to your customer of a week or two when it takes three to six months to manufacture is a very interesting challenge. It's the first time that I've ever actually been able to directly, explicitly apply learnings from class to a real world business environment. And that's a really unique and exciting thing. LGO gives you opportunities to take classes around things like logistics systems and systems optimization techniques and operations management that really give you some fundamental tools that you need to be able to go out and collect data and analyze the supply chain. And that's a really unique thing for me and I think it's been a really helpful thing uh, so far in my internship at Nike. I think they've been really surprised at how sort of out of the box you're ready to, to get started and to really understand some more elegant aspects of their supply chain. Um, so I've, I've never been able to use those tools so explicitly, and that, that's been really helpful. And I think another element of, of that that LGO brings to the table that's different than other places is that the exposure to the faculty and the connection to the faculty throughout the in internship process is really special because reality does not unfold necessarily the way it does in a, in a logistic systems problem set and the, the, the application of the tools can sometimes not be explicitly obvious. So being able to just pick up the phone or draft an email to a subject matter expert in the field is an invaluable experience. Lastly, I'd like to talk a little bit about the leadership connection. I think LGO really has a commitment to the L portion of Leaders for Global Operations because some of the tools that we've learned around leadership I think really help you to make an impact in an organization as big as Nike. Uh, as a you know a relatively small fish in a big pond. Um, so being able to lean on tools of leadership and organizational processes and team building uh, that you learn through LGO, it's very hands-on. Uh, it, it's, it's something that I, I've been able to use that I didn't know that I was going to need. And it's something I've been able to use to, to great effectiveness thus far in my internship.